which has always been popular. Kids like to buy and trade with their friends. Classic toys, which are the toys that mom and dad had as a child, toys they want to play with and reintroduce. And the toy industry is great at this because when they see another generation being formed, they want to bring back those memories. And the third C is crafting. A big trend right now is teenage girls making and then buying and selling collectibles made from slime and other materials. The toy industry, which is coming off an excellent year of 5% sales growth is being driven by innovation and ingenuity. The good news for consumers is that technologies that were just emerging a few years ago have become more affordable. Not only you get to control a paper airplane, but you actually get to experience flight as if you're flying on a paper airplane. You can see here we have a live streaming video that comes from the airplane and our kit includes also a VR viewer. You just slide it into, it, into the Google Cardboard and just by tilting your head up, down, right and left, you can actually control the airplane and see the, the world from the per perspective of the airplane itself. Toy makers are successfully using technology to enhance traditional toys rather than replace them. This is a Barbie hologram. Hello, Barbie. There she is. Hi there. It's so good to see you. So, what are we going to do first? The trend in educational toys that teach kids important concepts like science, technology, engineering, arts and math isn't going away. But it has transformed into STREAM, adding an R for robotics. So many boys and girls that have learned robotics in schools, have seen it in toys already, are really asking for more. So for example, Lego has a set called Boost, where you're actually using robotics and STEM and learning and coding all at the same time. And so kids are creating the play value of the toys that they make. Licensing has been a huge boon to the toy business for the past several years, capturing about 30% of total U.S. toy sales. And this year will be no exception, thanks to a wave of family-friendly movies hitting theaters. In addition to mashups, you're just seeing great, great storytelling coming alive on the retail shelf and on the toy shelf. We've got everything from um, Despicable Me 3 coming out. We've got more Star Wars, of course. Um, we've got Transformers. Along with their high-tech counterparts, low or no-tech toys are still expected to be popular in 2017. In New York, Laura Engel, Fox News. Okay, so Rolls Royce, look at that. <laughs> they have now made a special car so that sick children can drive to their surgery. Look at this. This is beautiful. The mini luxury car was rolled out yesterday for patients at a hospital in the UK. They top out at 10 miles an hour. Okay, so the company says this will help kids feel less anxious during their stay at the hospital. And the car is sweet. <laughs> That was cute. A new study of public pool says you're probably swimming in more than just water, Raul. Uh -huh.